right, coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Mark Hunt and Alexi Olenek. Well, good to see this young fighter make the walk here tonight. His takedowns are really some of the best in the game. So explosive, great technique behind them. Certainly, you see shades of his collegiate wrestling career. His opponent's got to watch out for those, but even an opponent with good takedown defense will succumb to this guy's shots. No telegraph behind him. When this guy wants to take you down, more often than not, he succeeds. This guy is a ground and pound expert. His specialty is controlling fighters and utilizing ruthless, destructive ground and pound techniques. So here is the bonus machine, the longtime heavyweight staple, the Super Samoan Mark Hunt. He's a powerful rhythmic striker, king of the walk-off knockout. You remember the fight with Bigfoot Silva in Brisbane back in 2013? Still ubiquitously regarded as the greatest heavyweight fight in UFC history. Mark Hunt back under the bright lights tonight. Apparently he worked tremendously hard on cardio for this camp. this heavyweight fight. Three years apart, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, the referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler with a professional record of 53 wins, 11 losses, and one draw. He stands 62 inches tall, weighing in at 240 pounds. Fighting out of Moscow, Russia, Alexei, the boa constrictor of the yeah. And now he produces his opponent. Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 13 wins, 12 losses, one draw, and one no contest. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting in Sydney, New South Wales, Australia, Mark Super Samoa! Oh! Okay, could take yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right now. You ready? Here we go. So here he is, the fan favorite, Mark Hunt, still going strong. We'll see how it goes here early in round one. This is a man who has worked very hard on his conditioning. So if we do hit the latter rounds, expect Hunt to be stronger than normal. And there he swung with a haymaker. Joe, your thoughts on what we'll see in this matchup tonight? Look out for the overhand right. Oh! oh huge right hand! Nice. Oh! Oh! He hurt him! He's got him right here. Oh, straight right. Oh! Immediately shoots for the leg. Now goes in and secures the takedown. There we go. Trying for a submission now. He's got that arm bar locked in. It's very close here. Getting tighter. Incredible. Just absolutely incredible. 
great job in getting this fight to the ground quickly and getting an early submission. Yeah, so how about that, Joe? We can barely tell people what color the trunks are on these fighters, and we get the submission win. So not a lot of wasted time. He got the takedown early, and the submission came soon thereafter. Great effort, great technique here tonight. And one more time from this angle, we can see that arm bar locked in tight for the tap. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. So there he is, your winner by submission. That could hold up as one of the better subs of the year. Near perfect execution tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At one minute, seven seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out due to an on bar. Alexi, the power constrictor, Alinia. Well, at this point, all that is left is the celebration, and it's nice to see this fighter sharing a moment with his coaches and training partners after the big submission win here tonight. He had no shortage of naysayers coming in. A lot of people said he couldn't come in here and submit a foe of this quality. Well, that should mute the masses a little bit. That should set him up for a big fight moving forward. Tonight, though, as I mentioned, all about the celebration, and it is on in the corner.